degrees on Friday. Let's talk about the the races uh, the, at uh, Talladega for the weekend, the forecast anyway, and it does look like we're going to be warm and muggy Friday and Saturday, and it looks like both of those days should be rain free. And then we are going to increase our rain chances a little bit more up to about a 40% chance on Sunday. 83 degrees. I think there'll be more clouds around on Sunday as well. And visibility looks good. Uh, according to Rick Carly, the campground is uh, open. So if uh, if you're camping, then by all means, head on out there, right? Visibility is good. As I mentioned, not a lot of fog in East Alabama at this hour. 548 is the current time and we are seeing some rain in West Alabama. You can see on our three minute advantage, especially up here in the parts of Pickens and also Lamar counties up near Detroit, Millport to some showers trying to approach those areas. Carrollton, Aliceville. Most of the rain today that we do see will be kind of west of I-65. Uh, so just to kind of keep your umbrella close by, especially if you do live west of the interstate with those higher rain chances there today. I think for most of the rest of us, about a 30% chance more clouds around high temperatures today in the mid and even upper 80s for this afternoon, especially in the eastern counties where we should get a little more sunshine. And then you can see kind of as we head through the day today, not a lot of widespread rain expected and really Friday and Saturday look to be pretty quiet and dry. And then by Sunday and Monday, rain chances coming up quite a bit. Uh, both of those days, especially by Monday, it looks like Monday is going to be a day where we'll have widespread showers and maybe a few embedded thunderstorms too. 86 today, we'll go with 87 Friday and Saturday, and then more clouds coming in Sunday and Monday, so not quite as warm. Higher rain chances as well, and it looks like we could get knocked down into the upper 70s too on Tuesday and Wednesday. Rick, how are the roads? Well, they're all right in the Birmingham Metro, but again,